We have a question here about the normal distribution. And it says that men's heights are normally distributed with a mean of 72 inches and a standard deviation of 3.1 inches. A social organization for short people has a requirement that men must be at most 66 inches tall. What percentage of men meet this requirement? So in terms of our standard distribution, we're given that mu, our mean, is 72, and our standard deviation, sigma, is 3.1. We want to know the probability that x is less than or equal to 66. Well, the first thing we're going to do is use this normal distribution formula to convert that to a z-score. So z is equal to x minus mu divided by sigma. So in this case, it's 66 minus 72 divided by 3.1 equals minus 1.9355. We'll round that to 1.94. So the equivalent z-score for this probability is the probability of z is less than minus 1.9355 is the same as the probability that x is less than 66. Uh, so now that we have this z-score, we can look that up on a standard distribution table like this one. And we're looking for 1.94, negative 1.94. So we're going to start here at negative 1.9. And then we're going to go here with that next digit is 4. And where those meet, 0 0.262, that's our probability. So we have the probability that x is less than or equal to 66 is 0 0.262. Now, that's the manual way to calculate this. Of course, if you have uh, Excel or R or SAS or a TI-84 calculator, you can just plug these numbers in and calculate it directly. But the good old-fashioned way with just a calculator and a z-score table, this is how you do it. You use the z-score formula to standardize your variable find out how many standard deviations from the mean you are, and then you look that up in the z-table, and this gives you the probability. I hope that helps. Have a great evening. We'll talk again later. Thanks.